shock as Festus Keyamo drags President Bola Tinumbu and federal government before the courts over appointments. Hello everyone, welcome to News 4 TV. In the recent revelation, the chief spokesperson of the Tinumbu Shetima Presidential Campaign Council in the 2023 general election and former Minister of State and Labor, Festus Keyamo San, has challenged President Tinumbu and the federal government to prove their legal stance and application of rule, rule of law in making his appointments. The legal practitioner argued how Mr. President would appoint service chiefs without the approval of the National Assembly. He said that the president lacked the statutory power to do so, but it remained a bizarre to him how he, Mr. President, succeeded in his appointment of service chiefs without seeking consultation and approval from the National Assembly and won. Meanwhile, Keyamo recalled and testified in his decisions that the present administration is copying era of President Goodluck Ebele Jonathan in processing key national positions. However, he contested that in a case like this, he is not expecting the former Lagos State Governor to win in his case in respect to his recent appointment because one cannot create a bound to change the law in the system. The legal luminary has claimed. The statement was revealed through Keyamo official Twitter page where he said that he's looking forward to seeing the compliance of federal government with the decision of the court in the case of Keyamo versus President and Federal Republic of Nigeria and other, wherein I challenge the powers of Mr. President to appoint service chiefs without the approval of the National Assembly and one. Um, so let me read the tweet exactly. It says, every single person kicked, picked so far by official Bolatinumbu are round pegs in round holes. I'm also pleased to see continuous compliance by the federal government with the decision of the court. In the case of Keyamo versus President and Federal Republic of Nigeria and another way in, I challenge the powers of Mr. President to appoint service chiefs ETC. Um, I note that the press release yesterday indicated the service chiefs need the approval of the National Assembly for the appointments to be confirmed. When you try to push the bounds of the law to change the system, you are bound to win some, lose some, and continue to pursue some. But the struggle must continue. Let's take some comments. Somebody said, Keyamo, are you talking about rule of law? Your Gabuari never obeyed rule of law. You never said a word. Now, you dragged the federal government to court. You are wrong, sir. Just keep quiet and allow peace to reign. Another said, I like his actions. If you like someone, you won't only smile to him or her, but talk to him man to man. Another person said, I thought Skeyama was the Numbu's man. Why taking him to court? All of you guys who stood against truth on the last presidential election and Peter Obi must be facing shame until you join your ancestors. Another said, serves you right. You can't eat your cake and have it. Another said, Keyama, what do you want me to do for you now with this shouting? Another said, this so-called Kiyama forgot too quickly that this Sinubu government started with tricks and will only exist with tricks. And the same Kiyama is among the brain that works against the wish of Nigerians. Another said, better day where you day, because that's where you belong. The other room is for people that are reasons and behave differently, not for people like you. Another said, I still prefer Sinubu's appointment to that of Buari. Another said, first of all, the way you made your bed so you rely on it. You can't cultivate corn and reap cassava. Another said, future Skeyamo, you are crying before the obedience. Tinumbuna, your mates. You are just crying this foul because they did not give you where you were promised. You are only brought in to launder the stains you vested on Tinumbu when he was a governor. They have no more use for you. Unto. Another said, charge and bail lawyer. Another said, a, back, a bad workman always quarrel with his tools. Mr. Lawyer, see chair near gutter, beg, trying to cover up, no go help you. Another said, you have started again, you are a chameleon. Another said, Keyamo, you never start to, to decry because bigger cry awaits you. Another said, is, is it not too early to drag your principal to court? I've been a prank. Another said, I think that this is a prank and a calculated attempt to mislead the masses. 
Another said, so people should leave him to walk. He has a dream for Nigerians. So just sit and watch how he's going to turn the country for better. He needs prayers now. Don't complain and pray for him. Another said, you, you forget one thing. People like Tinumbu don't have godfather and you cannot be his godfather. He wants to use Nigerians as godfather. And also, this is the first time someone who wants to be president has whatever. Check from Obasanjo to date. They beg Obasanjo to be president. Yaradu Obasanjo beg him. Good luck was forced to accept it. Buari cried out and said he's not going to contest again. ETC, ETC. Another said, a day will come when you will keep regretting all your evil deeds against humanity. The game is just starting, Kiyamo. Another said, you supported illegality from day one. You're going to see illegality to the highest order. As Nigeria a functional constitution, the evils you all supported will come haunting all of you. A country where a stand cannot define words. Mm. Another said, where were you when Buari was spending money from the Federation account without National Assembly approving such? Mechonu. Another said, it shook, it shook you. Someone that hasn't gotten his foot steady and you are dragging him to court over stolen mandates. Abba, first us. Another said, a game to bring distraction on what is already going on. Rot of thunder fire you, trying to deceive us. Another said, don't worry, son, don't cry. They will appoint you in the second half. Another said, do we have anything known as National Assembly? The Senate president said it's that he will continue approving whatever the president does. Another said, Keyamo, you know get shame. What post are you looking forward to get? Bat has already settled you with millions of pounds. My people no be no be so. Another said, This is a game you guys should stop disturbing our peace. Another said, I'm glad those who thought Inumbu will make them petroleum minister or give them Asso Rock to manage. Um we asked him because he only gave them banana peel. Another said, as we did sweet us, it did pain them. Kiyamo, how markets? Tinumbu, I did burden your appointments. Carry go. Another said, Kiyamo is not wise. Money don't enter in head. Nobody has asked about the 774,000 jobs, so 52 billion naira. Now, small money, the canal challenge is chi. Another said, Nademo, Kiyamo after his belly. Another said, politics is a game. Now you don't turn it out on your side. Feel it and enjoy. Another said, did you reject the unconstitutional appointment as the Minister of State for Works under Buari's administration? Another said, I love Tinumbu for this. That's why the fact that he did not win the election for this one, I love it. Another said, it is like Festus Kiyama never knew what will happen in the days to come. They might send him to jail for his past sins. Must be involved in Tinumbu's Jagaban, Bala, Blue, Bulaba government. Mm. Another said, Is Kayamo not Tinumbu's slave again? What changed suddenly? Another said, Is now you want to display your frustration? No appointment for you. Kayamo, no job for you in this government. Another said, Festus Kayamo, your cup is full. When you were there, the appointments were, were good, right? Buari appointed 90% of the Northerners into his cabinet. He said nothing against it. Even that men do lives with them. Another commenter said, A house divided against itself. Kiyamo, channel your grievances and displeasure through the right place. Don't say you're not warned. Another said, Where were you when Buari was appointing Fulanis only to all leading positions? Now it's clear you don't have conscience. Another said, If he had appointed you, there wouldn't be any case. Tinumbu equals APC equals National Assembly. You never see anything yet. Another said, so Mr. Kiyamon, they did not give you anything at all. At all, calm down. Maybe they're planning to make you head of all agribos in Nigeria. Another said, Nigerians are wise. How many times did you correct the errors in the government you were part of? I beg, go sit down. Another said, a consistently inconsistent individual. Maybe he has sensed that there's nothing for him. Another said, I laugh. Mr. President, God will lead and guide you. They should leave him to do his work. God bless Nigeria. Another said, Li Life now turn by turn. Kayamo, go sit down. I beg. After all your ranting, now you wake. You don't wake. No post for you. Go and sit down. Mm. Another said, Was Mr. Kayamo not there when his former master was wasting 
the country's resources without due process of the law. Kiyama is either looking for appointment or avenue to keep his loot away from the prey eyes of Tinubu's administration. The payback time is here with us. And as I said, this is happening because they are seeing there are no political appointment or office for him upon the lies they engage in order to favor Tinumbu, selfish human being. Another commenter said, continue to make noise. Are service chiefs not part of the executive arms controlled by the president? Another said, sorry, you don't have it. You don't have to play with our intelligence. Sure, you know Bat much better. You are only saying this because you feel short changed. Fallon or two became antagonist when Malami was picked instead of him. So we knew your types. Another said, many believed the man has nothing to offer. Now that there is a sign that he may do well, allow him to try. Let him select the team that he believes in. This is his chance to make good name for himself and Nigeria. Please don't spoil things for him. Another said, Kiyamo, if you're not satisfied with the appointment, go to court. Another said, the president has a veto power. So do that. And besides, you are biting more than what you can chew, indirectly begging for political appointments. Uh, another said, the almighty God will expose and reward the evildoers, politicians, and Nigerians. Another said, seeking for recognition. Your mates are running their private businesses, but you guys have settled your mind, clamoring for this political position or the other. You will soon speak the truth that Inumbu didn't win, that if they exited in drawing you closer. Hmm. Another said, um, the beginning of the end of opportunistic bunch. Another said, this Tinumbu is very intelligent. He knows those who genuinely love and loyal to him for rewards over and against appointment seeking busybodies and psychophants. Kiyamo and FFK had in the past made very damning remarks about Tinumbu and I think Tinumbu is not in a hurry to forget, to forget all those bad days. So, place for visibility for these fake later days apostles another said if mr president we appoint all his family members as his cronies into government offices i don't see any bad if only they can move the country to the promised land what we need in this country is better performance we should allow mr president to continue doing the needful another said it was appointment he was looking for that was the reason he has been speaking with sugar-coated mouth and supporting tinumbu now that nothing is favoring him he's going to court another said Kayama unto you never see anything now the beginning be this very soon you'll be chased out lagos chased out of lagos one down one to go waiting for ffk stone now i go clear another said i won't be surprised when Kayama testified in court that tinumbu did not win the election uh, so these are many more are the reactions so the question is is the honeymoon over because if we must be very um truthful Kiyama was at the forefront of being a spokesperson during the campaign as the um the front burner of the campaign committee and he tore down any opposition with his words and very swift on social media platforms you know I don't know whatever has gone wrong but hey is it a prank that they are playing on our intelligence or is it just reality of what is going on and how quickly can in quotes love affair turn into such hatred please drop your comments in the comment section below thank you so much for watching do remember to like share and subscribe to our channel to our new subscribers thank you for joining and to our existing subscribers thank you for always stopping by we'll see you in the next video may god bless nigeria bye for now